What's good YouTube? It's your boy GK and I'm back with another video. Today we are going to be teaching you guys some ISO moves and everything you need to know about Hoop City early access. Uh, and yeah, let's get right into it. So basically, I'm making a dribble tutorial kind of, you could say, but I'm using the moving minutes and before we get into that, I'm going to show you guys my input settings. I know it was a lot of you saying, oh, the game is delayed and oh, I feel like my dribbling is too slow. Well, I have settings for you guys for keyboard and mouse players. I wouldn't necessarily say Xbox players. I don't know if 0.3 will work for Xbox, but I know for keyboard and mouse players, you are going to need these settings. These settings actually helps you with uh, spin moves, Euro steps, when you want to hop step back to the side, just dribbling in general. So... If you want to learn how to spin move, you don't hold sprint, you double tap E, lay up. If you want to dunk, which this build can't necessarily dunk, you don't sprint, double tap E, hold shift again, and hold E, and you will be able to dunk. So hold on, I'm going to show you guys. Double tap E, and then you hold shift again, and uh, sprint, and then hold E. I don't know why I shot, it, but, and if you guys want a Euro, you could dribble. Hold shift and then double tap E into the euro. And one other thing, you got handles. If it's above, if it's 80 or above, double tap whichever hand it's in. It's double crossover. So if it's in the right hand, double tap C. If it's in the left hand, double tap Z as in zebra. And for double behind the back, if it's in your left hand, ZX, double tap X. And if it's in your right hand, CX, double tap X. And uh, now I'm going to get into my favorite move that I've made and created. This is like kind of before y'all were able to play, like early access and stuff. It's called the Grandpa Slide. I'm going to show you different variations of it uh, from like fadeaways and just regular shot. And this is mostly, mainly for those builds that don't have that double step back, I mean the double behind the back and the double crossover, like slow builds like a spot up shooter, you see it doesn't necessarily dribble as fast as the uh, moving menace. But basically if you wanna get yourself open, say if somebody was guarding you right here, you know what I'm saying? And obviously you're a spot up shooter, so they're gonna expect you to just shoot, like you wanna shoot. That's their mindset. So you could dribble, go, step back, hop step backwards and just shoot, let that mug fly. And it creates so much space. And it'll create more space if you have this badge called Separation Artist, if you had it higher. Like if it was like Ruby, like with the Moving Menace, I'm going to show you how, how much it creates. So you will go, Grandpa Slide, look how much space it creates. It takes you all the way back to the three-point line. Hold on. Let me go back. So you will go. how much space it creates now I'm gonna sit there and put these uh, two videos side by side it's gonna be a comparison of separation artists with bronze and for uh for Ruby so you'll step back as you can see it doesn't bring you back as far as the uh, moving menace so I'm gonna make a comparison and yeah that's pretty much it about hoop city uh, if you don't have this game yet and you're wanting to buy this game I'm gonna drop a link in the description and you have to buy the game pass which is like 400 it's under the store tab of the game and I'm going to drop the hoop city discord in my description and my discord and obviously you guys can see uh, at the bottom that my discord is right there so if you want to add me i do add back please i don't bite bro but yeah that's pretty much it make sure you guys like and subscribe press that bell down below so i can give you more tips and tricks and what's coming new in uh hoop city and yeah gk signing out Just talk to your homie, she said we should be together